Hello, hello. Yee, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Dr. Kill, you am early. Or am I late? Guys, I know I just went live, but a good friend, Bane Meets World, is uh, Whatever. I guess it doesn't work. doing a 12 hour stream for the Trevor Project ah, damn it! right now. So if you want to go over there and then come back later, that's totally cool. And use some kind of voodoo spell to bring us to life. Oh, you regret that now. What did they do to him? It's too weird to meet your god. But if you do decide to stay here, we're playing Judgment. I'm partially late because I was watching Bane. How is everyone? Let's see what happened last time. In the roaring din of the city, the death of the ADDC's vice director hardly made a sound. Behind his death are the vast profits of the AD9 drug. Yagami arrives at the possibility that all the deaths were premeditated. But the prosecution's eye for such detail Oh yeah, I forgot Ayabe is a bad boy. For murder. I mean, we always knew he was a bad boy, but he might be a real bad boy. Chapter 8. I think there's 12 chapters. Striations on the recovered bullet are a perfect match to his firearm. There's no That's a really short previously. He's the one. Like previously on. going down. Recap. That was a short recap. That's what I'm trying to say. Apologies for keeping you in the dark. It was imperative for Ayabe to be completely oblivious to our suspicions of him after all. Previously this is a on Avatar. Against an active officer. Next time to on Dragon play, Ball it takes more Z. To actually make an arrest. So, we had to pretend you were our primary suspect. He's got such you a and I deep have voice. To be pretty cozy these days. Suspecting you was the perfect way to divert his attention. I see. So this was all some kind of act. An act? Not at all, I assure you. And I believe you should know. We're aware of Ayabe's side job. You done did Ayabe the things? Informant, Appreciate you. Spy. He was selling police intel on the black market. We plan to investigate those transactions thoroughly, Yagami-san. And so... How is everyone tonight? In the slightest if we see you again in the near future. Speak of the devil. We were just talking about you, Ayabe-san. Listen, Yagami, you gotta help. Someone set me up. They're saying I killed Shitani. Me. Me. Uh-huh. You're not surprised? Not quite. I already <laughs> heard. Nice. What'd you have for dinner? I'm sitting here with the prosecution as we speak. I did pretty I I'm pretty good. Yeah. They're looking right at me. Please, Yagami, you have to take my case. I don't know where else to turn. Oh my pizza, nice. Okay. I'll do it. I don't think I ate dinner. It's only fair after all you've done. We can talk more later. I'll be there soon. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't know. I just went live. I can't go get food right now. So, I'll see you in court then. Who do you have on the job? Izumita? Should be a good time. Hey, some more stream. Yeah, a quick Someone mukbang. Using you, prosecutor. No matter who that person is, 
I'm not losing. So that's the story, Kenda Sensei. We're gonna take the case. Uh, of course we are. Mm, of course we are. Anyway, you're gonna go talk to Ivy. I did have we I did go to a new ramen place yeah, for lunch. That was pretty right good. Now. And then we went to a chocolate cafe, and I got no chocolate. I got um, a lemon berry mascarpone cheesecake thing. Uh, Hoshino kun should have made it. Oh, okay, I was reading that. That's fine. Hoshino. It's so good. This is like the fourth or fifth one I've been to. It might be my new favorite one. I'm not sure yet. It had my favorite broth out of any of them. That's for sure. And we got, uh... My wife and I both got... Uh, shoyu ramen with extra egg. And, um... We got chowshu pork buns as an appetizer. I do too, we had to drive pretty far. Well, pretty far, it was like 20-30 minutes. But... Yeah, I, I have to go 20 minutes to get anywhere worth going to. At least 20 minutes. Ooh. Knock, knock. I've been waiting for you, Yagami-san. Oh, I've been here. We can go see Ayabe whenever you want. We'll just need to grab a taxi to get there. Okay, let's go right now. Uh, I need to get rid of that marker. Okay, okay. What's going on? Here we go. That's fine. An hour? Yikes. An on-duty detective arrested for murder. I live in Ohio, so... Now this is a shock. This is not too bad. Do I live, like, just outside this of the big cities. From the or in the suburbs office. of the big he's cities. Young, he's reliable. Oh, here I thought the great Takayuki Yagami would represent me. It's been years since I defended someone in court. I'll still be gathering all the evidence, though. Don't worry. It worked for Hamra. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I'll do you don't need to. to clear your name. We do have good roller coasters, but other than that, there's no reason. Your boss, yeah? If I'm really the killer. Well, I mean, you're not the killer, right? Uh, he's not the killer, is he? Probably not. What do you mean? Yeah, you need to see all the attractions like that. The hell is real sign. A grandpa's cheese barn. I need to get the fact straight before I can defend I Ibe. Your guns, the one Shintani was murdered with. Yep. Apparently the rifling on the Andrew passed matched. the hell's real sign today. Um what's rifling again? Really? Uh the giant longa burger basket. So, guns have these spiral shaped grooves on the inside of the barrel to stabilize the bullet's trajectory. These grooves are called the rifling and leave a mark on the bullet itself. Whoa. Now the rifling's slightly different on every gun. Kind of like it's fingerprints. Ooh, we yeah. have like the beginnings of mountains to towards the south, Shintani but matched my gun's rifle. I love so mountains, dude. So your gun must have killed Shintani Sensei. Yeah, it was the murder weapon for sure. So someone used my gun to commit the crime, and I'm being set up. Someone went through the trouble of stealing a detective's gun just to kill Shintani. How? You remember the day he died? We were having a nice stiff drink at Tender. You, me, and Kaito. Yeah, I remember. That was my first time meeting Kuroiwa. 
I hung around after you guys beat it. It wasn't a while till I decided to go home. Thing is, I don't remember what happened next. Huh? I was drugged. Someone smacked me in the back of the head. Oh, that's not a drug. So I couldn't see him. That's a bat. You got ambushed? Where was this? Close to the bar, I bet. But I'm not sure. It all happened so damn fast. Some great detective work there. What do you expect? Whoever knocked me out moved me too. That just fucks with things even more. Moved you to where? Random bench over in the Kamurocho Children's Park. Not a soul around when I came to. Cold. It must have taken you in a car. How long were you out for? I have a blanket back so over comes. there, but so far but away. As I found out later, that hours when Shintani was murdered with my fucking gun. So the real killer still has your gun? No. It was in its holster when I woke up. <laughs> Great. What? Whoever attacked me took my gun, murdered Shintani, and put it back where they found it, all within the course of an hour. So the only thing missing was a bullet? Not even that, if you believe it. They got rid of any sign it had ever been used. Maybe if we look at the bullet from Shintani's body... Not gonna happen. Nothing spectacular about a single bullet. So we can't prove the murderer stole the gun. By the way, did you tell anyone you got attacked? No. I mean, nothing even got stolen. Reporting it just would have put me in more trouble. Don't want to draw attention to your side job, huh? It sucks being a dirty cop. A real detective could have reported it. Huh. Can't argue there. The culprit must have been counting on that, though. They went after you specifically because they knew you wouldn't make a big deal out of it. So it was all planned. Planned or not, the bullet that killed Shintani ended up with your gun's rifle marks on it. There's no denying that. Yep. I only found out when they hauled me in, though. No surprise, they suspect me. There's no reason not to at this point. But none of my co-workers said a damn word. Mm, kind of rude. Hey, you know how Kuroi always been dragging me all over town with him? He probably just wanted to make sure I didn't skip town. Only just realized that now. What did you say is your alibi? You were knocked out in the park? Not a very believable story. Come on. You and I both know I didn't kill him. Somebody's pinning it on me. <sighs> what do you say, Yagami? You think I got a chance? <laughs> you'll be no. just fine. What? I mean, yeah, you'll be great. <laughs> Guess that was a dumb question. Nobody's going to tell a guy his head's on the chopping block. It's pretty good. If you're familiar with the Yakuza games, it's kind of a spin-off. They don't like to call it a spin-off, but it's basically a spin-off. Listen up, Oshinoko. Except you're playing as a private private investigator instead of a Yakuza. You really trust the of the games, yeah. That's kind of how I am. This is my first one in that universe that I've played. I'm liking it though. You wouldn't kill, especially not with his own gun. Someone else did this. You think it's the mole? That's the most obvious suspect. Let's start by talking to someone close to the case. I've got a guy. It's mind. this is like a remaster, but it's just old enough that you're like, hmm. Some of the things didn't age super well. It's true. Like some of the character models and animations, like the hairs, almost good. Better than I could do. Well. But I'll head back that's, to the office then. That goes without I saying. Tell Genda Sensei what we learned. But it's got some weird textures and physics. Oh, uh, where am I going? Ooh, wait, wait. Find a way to meet Matsugane. How do I just find a way? Yeah, shucks. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> That's fair. Um, I did. This is Doa. Oh, well, good. Kill knows Doa. 
Um, I won't catch him. Maybe Matsugane might be able to track him down. Who do I know that's gotten in with Matsugane son? I don't know. Who do we know? Um, people. I forget who Matsugane is. Um, that's not gonna help. Um, shoot. Uh, I started going to school for. Well, I guess I'll just run it for um, video game development. Uh, but then I realized that, man, that's hard, dude. Now I got my friend the Eagle Dev, so, you know, I'll live vicariously through him. <laughs> Speaking of which. Who do I know? Gosh darn. What's this? Guess I'm about to find something. We go now to our story on Tatsu Ogamo, the escaped convict from Hokkaido's Abashiri prison. Abashiri? Convicted and murdering a member of a criminal organization three years ago, Gamo's sentence had only just begun. However, police are calling for caution after he was found to have escaped at dawn on the 5th of last month. What? According to reports released by Tokyo PD today, there is reason to believe he may be sheltering in Kamurocho. Authorities are asking that any sightings of Gamo be reported immediately and urging citizens to take precautions. It's worth noting there there is a 1.2 million yen reward for info that leads to his capture. Burger Fugitive. X, another day in life here in Kamurocho, huh? Sucks running that guy. A reward that big? Probably worth keeping an eye out at least. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll keep an eye out for that guy, I guess. Find a way to meet Matsugane. Did it? Matsugane. That. There. Patriarch of the Matsugane found Toto he report he supported Yagami as he struggled to pass the bar exam. Yagami thinks of him like a father. However, he was unable to protect Kaito from expulsion after hundred million and was stolen else. Oh Okay, that's Matsugane. So maybe I can go this nope 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 uh, nope nope maybe Dude, I could take a hundred ten thousand. <sighs> Heck, I'd take a thousand dollars. Heck, I'd take a dollar. <laughs> I'm waiting for them taxes to hit, dude. Found out today that uh, it's going to take almost three thousand dollars to fix my mouth. That's fun. I'm excited, dude. And then I'm gonna put a chunk of change on my PC. Huh? Looking for Higashi Anaki? 
He's back in his office. Okay. Knock, knock. What do you want? Sticking your nose where it doesn't belong again? Yeah, but I got, um, like, caps on my, on some of my teeth. And, like, this one specifically is just broken. No way he's gonna stick around. So, I gotta get those fixed. Amara and the boss are in the same boat. Those Kilray assholes would hunt him down in an instant if they were easy to track. Exactly. Wherever they are now. And they have to be custom fit. No idea where that made of porcelain. Can't you at least get in touch with them? Just say we want to have a few words. I can try. I'll let you know once I figure shit out. You know how to pick up a phone, yeah? Yeah. Thanks. Cause like I got two down here that are more or less fine, but they're like kid caps. So they don't fit quite right and they're trapping a lot of the mole framed it. Like plaque or whatever. Really behind all of this. Ammo deficiency. Yeah. That covers brings us right back to Hammer. Yeah. We'll start from him and go from I've had a few root canals is where some of these caps came from. I had one on this no point well, on a tooth over here, they got two root canals, and only ever got um, temporary fillings, and it just rotted underneath the cap. And so when they eventually decided, okay, I guess we have to pull that. Excuse me. Uh, they took off the cap, and when they went to grab the tooth. It just crumbled, and it was, it was, I hated it. It was so upsetting. Yeah, they're not great. Which, that's another thing. I have, I think it's on this side. I have some fillings that are just really old, and um, they need redone. That's part of the cost. And I need a deep clean because those areas around those caps, I got some like deep pockets in my gums, which is part of why I need the big boy caps. Well used rubber. Gross. Sorry. Sorry. What's up? Stretchy rubber. Great. Keep up, huh? mm, can't go down there. Okay. Mm, do I need to eat? Oh, I don't need that button. Do I need to eat? Uh, not really. Just like real life. Yeah, I don't really need to eat. Oh, that's awesome. I'm also just bad at, like, flossing and shit. But I'll, I'll blame my ADHD. Oh, I could... Just do that real quick. Easy peasy, like. What's over here? Oh, Club Sega. Fighting Vipers, Fantasy Zone. Oh, we could play some Virtua Fighter 2. Jeffrey. Jeffrey McWild. Yeah. 
you get him, Jeffrey. Oh, I missed. Never played Virtual Fighter. Oh, Sarah, you're way better than the last guy. Oh, heck yeah. Time to change my, uh, ah, shoot. My stream stuff to, uh, my stream info to Virtua Fighter. Get her, Jeffrey. Get her. Hell yeah. I win. Ah, shun. Oh. Anyway. Nice. I love that for you, Jeffrey. Oh, no. Got him. Easy squeezy. I win. Fight one. Ready, go. Oh, I knocked your bread out. Sorry, Pi. Ah! You can grab in this game? Uh-oh, she is way better than me. Kick her! Oh, shoot. I don't know what she said to me. Uh -oh. oh my goodness gracious. Jeffrey, get up! Oh, Jeffrey. You lose. Yeah. No. That's good. Dude, my foot is so flipping asleep. Sarah to mess me up. I don't think that was Sarah. I think I think her name was Pi. What is this? Fantasy Zone. Sarah did mess me up though. What's this? Virtual Fighter 5? This place is all Virtual Fighter. Fighting Vipers? Oh, hello. Hello? Yo, it's Higashi. Hey, <laughs> that's Dr. Steve Blue. What do you say? Meet at a restaurant called Kamuroki Kanoya. The way's out of the city. Take a cab. Box is already there. Got it. Thanks, Higashi. Don't keep him waiting. Okay, where's nearest cab? Opposite direction. Sorry. Mm, that way. All right, I'll go this way. Places to be. Let's roll, oh, here's a cab right here. Matsugane-san, 
Our guests have arrived. Good. Get doors like that for my office. Please take a seat. Should also get an office. It's been some time, Tom. Eh, Flathe. And you I haven't seen since your expulsion. Yes, sir. Matsugani san. I'm sure he's Fluffy, got thank you for this, contributing. I want to ask you directly. Come now. How are you? Let's at least have a drink first, huh? <laughs> if you say so. Here. Place is pretty fancy. It's Good. Three How are you started. feeling? I'm pretty okay. Can't really complain. Had a pretty decent day. Went to a ramen shop with Goopy. Went to a chocolate cafe with Goopy. But Tuck, I have a favor to ask. You need to stay away from Hamura. What? This family is nothing without him. Hell, he's the only thing keeping us afloat. Yeah, you told me that already. Same old, same old. Where is he? I don't know. Yeah. He has no reason to keep me informed of his every move. Then why did you call us here? We didn't need to come all this way if that's all you had to tell us. Boys. Uh oh. Hmm, I'm seeing some character models being Boss. reused. I don't understand. My boy. You need to stay away from Hamura. The mole's my top priority now. And Hamura is the only person I can ask. Don't you understand? Hamura's been compromised. Him and that mole you're chasing, they're in this together. Time to let it go. What if I say no? I couldn't tell you what might happen. He's dangerous. What do you mean he's dangerous? If you can't tell me that, why should I stop? Amara, the boy has money on his side, and a lot of it. And I don't know who he gets it from. I suggest you don't push the matter. But if you really want to put yourself in harm's way, then let me be the one to do it. At least then you'll make it out alive. You do that? You know... You and Kaito, well, I've always tried to keep you two kids safe. All this time, I've never asked for anything in return. But here we are. This is the only thing that I'll ever ask of you. Abandon this pursuit of the mole. If you've ever held a shred of regard for me, then heed this one request. I'm not turning back. The risk doesn't matter anymore. Okubo, the mole, the ADDC, it all connects. This isn't about what regard I have for you. I won't stop. Then I'm sorry. <clears throat> Boss. I've always looked up to you. And good Yakuza don't disobey. But now... I'm in Yagami's corner, damn it. Yes, that you are. Matsugane-san! Higashi. Uh, sir. Pick your side. I've had enough. You're Matsugani, are you not? I am, boss. <laughs> Prove it then.
Gotta beat up my friend. <laughs> Bad luck, dude. Guess we're doing this, huh? Not like we got a choice. And now that we're up against the wall, you're just gonna have to do it. Let's see what you've got! I'm sure he's gonna be just fine. Time to die! Okay. Could put your shoes on first top. I think they would have allowed that. Okay. Be sorry. What you got? What's wrong? Get him. I pressed so many buttons. Yeah, I don't think it worked. <laughs> oh, shoot. Now I have the sword. No, don't throw it, cat. Idiot. Oh, oh, heal, please. Oh, no, I hope I have healing items. Oh, right, here we go. Um, and inject angels. I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die so dead. I'm gonna die so dead. Um. There we go. Start with all those explosions and still almost lost. This could be a thumbnail. That was simple for you two. Far too simple. Thanks, I cheated. Makes me realize how old I really am. It's a shame, isn't it? That I've all but faded away. Ah, time sure flies, my boy. 
just gets worse and worse with every year. Damn tragic. Matsukane. Twenty years ago. Not gonna be that easy. Huh. You're really laying it on him, Kaito. Oh, boss. Is this the Yagami kid you were talking about? Yep. Happens every fucking time I run into the guy. So, asshole. You uh get some kind of sick pleasure out of him beating the crap out of you? Time after time, you just keep coming back for seconds. You all right in the brain, kiddo? I'm saner than you, you bullshit Yakuza. Huh. Bullshit Yakuza, huh? Some rotten attitude you got there. Hey, why don't you go fuck yourself? Who the fuck do you think you are? Back in the day, I was a lot more like you than I think you even know. I was in a real bad place, so I just started punching anything that pissed me off. And before long, my time was up. Nowhere left for me to go except this cesspool of a city. And you, my boy, that's exactly where you are. Don't talk like you know me. You don't know shit. Oh, but I do, you see. When I was your age, my life was going down the shitter and I just kept flushing. And now, <laughs> you, my boy, you're the same little punk I was. I can tell. You know, sometimes people have no choice but to turn to the Yakuza. But even if my chance is gone, You've got a future ahead of you. <clears throat> now, I might have called this place a cesspool. But it's more than that. Kamurocho. It's a city of dreams where even from the gutters you can shoot for the stars. So if you want to get ahead in this town, well, kid, I'll teach you everything I know. But look, if nothing else, you might want to lay off your little date nights with Kaito. <laughs> and times like these? It's hard to even enjoy a drink. The mole you're searching for is a hired gun employed by Hamura. An assassin? Yes. It seems Hamura always turns to the same person when he needs someone taken care of. That's your killer, without a doubt. Do you know anything about him? No. But whoever he is, he's a goddamn pro. He's killed several people now the exact same way, yet barely left a trace. Do you know what he looks like at least? No. The only one who does is Hamura. Are you still going to pursue this, Tuck? That's the plan. You should know. Even if you track down Hamura and the mole, that won't be the end of it. They're just puppets on a stage much larger than you realize. And once you step foot on that stage, there's no hiding from the limelight. Do you understand? I'd rather try and regret it than never try at all. <laughs> Nobody listens to their elders these days. Sorry about this, boss. Seriously.
Can I just say one thing, Matsugane-san? What is it? The Matsugane family I know would never turn a blind eye to cold-blooded murder like this. You say you can't exist without Hamura, but... Don't make me repeat myself. Times have changed. Hamura is the Matsugane family now. It's not my place to interfere anymore. That's my prerogative as patriarch. Matsugane-san. Thank you for everything. All that, still no clue where Hamura is. We're back to square one. Not exactly. The boss slipped us a pretty big hint. Oh yeah? When he was talking about Captain Hamura. Hmm? He might be in hiding, yeah. But the family looks to Hamura for guidance now. He's gotta be communicating with them somehow. If we can just listen in on one of their conversations, that should lead us straight to him. We just gotta get ears in there. You follow me? I think I do. You wanna bug their office. Exactly. True. That might lead us straight to Hamura. But after everything that just went down, you know what'll happen if we get caught. They'll kill us. Which means we'll just have to enlist the help of an expert burglar. Uh -huh. mm. You wanna make Sugira do it? I'll give him a ring. You go track down some bugs. Me? Make sure they're HD audio and shit. Meet me at the office once you've got them. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. We can't afford to do this half-assed. Oh, I thought I was going... If it's technology, I need Sukuma. If it's technology... Okay, so, okay. Well, that was... Whatever. This way! Oh... Wait, I need to heal. Sukuma's gonna have to wait. I need to go... Here, shoot. That didn't... I need to go visit my sewer doctor. Huh. Those hags were older than time, dude. I'm kind of hungry. But it's so late. I don't know if I want to eat this late, you know? Ah, bad guys. No, I don't have to worry about that. Hmm. Hmm? Who's this from? Uh. Sewer Doctor. Twenty thousand yen. Okay. I don't really have money to buy anything else. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick BRB. I think I'm gonna get a snacky snack. Okay, I back. A little snacky snack. Got a blankie. Misaligned my end screen. Ugh.
Okay. Have I been getting money from this thing? Doesn't feel like it. Now look, the threat level's already gone down just by standing around. Excuse me. Okay. Doing this. Where's the big guy? I didn't want to do that. There we Honda again, dude. I just healed. Children's Park, right? Yeah. Pretty good. We're doing. Oh, come on. More bad boys. Bring it on. on this. We are. Uh, I'm doing a birthday party tomorrow. Just left the sewer doctor, dude. 
Um, can't afford any of this, dude. Uh, I have an extract that gives me like a sale. <laughs> That's not going to work on the other part, but at least let me heal. Okay. Well, I guess I'll be back later. Server doctor. You were no help. It was your fault, not mine, I'm sure. Of me, help. What a waste! Yeah, I can't do anything. This dude won't get off me. Cops, arrest this man. That guy died. How oh, you son of a bitch. Dude. 
Miyazaki. Okay, can't use any of this. Thanks, Fluffy. <laughs> Stop, dude. Really, guys? <sighs> Just me in here. Oh. <sighs> Well, I'm glad I can make you giggle. And I appreciate the lurk. Yeah, giggle quick. I know what you're saying. Mushy, mushy. Hey, Tsukumo. Oh, Yagamishi. What is it this time? I'm trying to keep this on the down low here. But I'm looking for bugs. Think you can help me with that? <laughs> you know who you're talking to, right? Of course I can. Thought so. Well, any time works for me as long as I've got the parts. You're gonna make them by hand? I won't find a safer pair of hands than literally my pair of hands. Plus, you get a friend discount. I'm oh, sick because I'm so. broke as shit, dude. Anyway, what do you need? I'll run to a department store and pick them up. <laughs> no need. Here's a riddle. You can get me from here, but I am not here. What am I? What? <laughs> Online shopping! Things get here in no time with rush shipping. I'll just need you to give me the cash. How much are we talking? For parts and labor, let's say... a hundred thousand? That's with your friend discount? <laughs> yes, sir. I'm taking a loss on it for you, Yagamishi. <sighs> All right. Just let me know when you have the money, and I'll put the order in. I'm so broke, dude. I'm so broke. I have to go make money now? Oh, you, uh, damn it. I can't afford to go to the doctor. It's just like real life. <laughs> I can't afford to go to the doctor. I can't afford fucking uh, 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 bug my enemy's house. I. Ooh, so many bad boys, dude. Where's the Koi Bride or whatever the fuck it's called? Kanban Wife? No. Queen Ruse, Sana Goten, KJ Art, Johnny Family Office, Game Center Charles, Koi Bride, right over here. Freaks drop in money. No, no, great. Oh, you guys moved the tree. Help, I'm broke! Probably not something you want to say when you walk into a casino. I can't.
I can't cash out. I guess I could do side gigs for money. If I find that one guy, that's 1.2 million yen, dude. What if I go to like a department store? Or what's a convenience store, probably. Must we? There's 10,000. I can afford to heal again. Died to death, dude. Flaw. Sure. Blah. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry. Running out of bikes. Really, guys? I don't remember if I can sell shiat or not. Really, guys? Um, 
let's head back here. I think there's might be some. I think there might be some food in my office that should help me heal. Jeez. Thanks for coming out today, Yosuke-san. You've got a new job for me, right? <laughs> you don't have to be so formal with me, Yagami-san. I'm younger than you, anyway. Yeah, you got it. So, tell me about this new pervert. He's one of the Twisted Trio. This one's name is Ass Catch'em. Huh? Ass Catch'em? Really? Only where we're laughing matter. This guy is, has ass on the mind and he'll grope whatever he can grab. I guess he's... Oh, oh, here's a hydrate for you, Fluffy. And Tsukino-san was one of his victims. Yep, and that was in broad daylight just the other day. And you're sure it's the Twisted Trio again? What gave him away? It's what he said when I turned around in horror. I don't want to read that. I don't want to read any of this stuff. I don't want to read any of this stuff. Jeez, this is a lot of dialogue about some guy named Ass Ketchum. I'm on it. That's how I feel, girl. Little looking yagami son. Any sketchy perverts catch your eye? Just one. Small child in a sweater. No, nothing yet, but don't let your guard down all the same. Hmm. What the? Let's see where I should probably hurry up and capture this pervert. Dark room glasses, thick stubble, shaven head. Hey. What the? Okay, he meshes the description. Mm -hmm. Who dresses like that? Ain't nothing but bad vibes here. I better get in touch with Yosuke. Behind you!
cheese is first. Gotta catch them all. Uh, it's a it's a dragoon. Hey, dragoon, what's up? I'm so proud of you, Des. Thank you for contributing. <laughs> Impressive. You did great, Dragon. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to see these two again. How are you? How is Lethal Company? Did you win? Oh, delivery. Um, great. I don't know. Lethality, fun time, hell yeah. I still can't find this dude. I'll be waiting at M Side Cafe in a navy jacket with the bro. Uh, chicken's pretty good. Can't complain. I should probably be in bed, to be honest, but here I am. What's this? That's where Sukumo is. Where? Nope. Oh, shoot. What's it called? M side cafe. Place a pin. Well, because we're doing a, like a joint birthday party at Kosai for the kids tomorrow morning. So we have to leave here a little before 10. So I should probably be in bed. But Eagle. Oh, Eagle Dev, you should definitely be in bed, dude. Boodles. How are you though? Hated that. Fucking hate that clip, dude. Persona 3 was pretty good. Um, I'm going to be continuing it. I do think... The same...
ban him. Get him out of here. Uh. I, I, I will say Persona 3, uh, so far, slower start than Persona 5. At least not grabbing me nearly as quickly as Persona 5. But I'm going to keep at it for at least now. I'll give it a couple more streams before... I mean, I'll probably play the whole thing, to be totally honest, but... I'm also, I was so attached to the Persona 5 characters, I'm like, these are different characters. Which I knew would be the case, that's obvious, but... Still, though. How the flip-flop do I get in this place? Play Persona 5 Tactic instead? Mm, I could. Or I could keep playing Persona 3. That's the I Miss Persona 5 game? Yeah. That tracks. I do appreciate the reload is got like a lot of quality of life stuff that's similar to Persona 5. Damn, son of a bitch. Wow, I hit him so hard we got transported outside of where we are. Oh, you bitch. Play Flappy Bird, 100% Flappy Bird. I have an iPod somewhere around here with Flappy Bird on it. You hear the music isn't as good, really? And reload. I mean. I'm enjoying it so far. It's it's not as jazzy as Persona 5, but it's more hip hoppy. And I don't hate that. Okay. Oh, wait. Something on the stairs? Come here, fool. Uh-oh! Pain! Pain! Dead. I died, and I'm dead. God... Darn it. Oh, when was the last time? Hopefully after the... I beat Ass Ketchum's... face in. How much money do I have? Thank God. Okay. What's a uh, Persona 4's music? Classical? I I like classical music. What's, um, have you played Persona 1 or 2? I'm honestly Magnus. <laughs> yeah, this game again, dude. Let's go then. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to figure out where the oh. fluff I am. J-Rock and J-Pop. I do like that, too. Where's this M side, dude? It's the only clip. It's better than flipping Eagle's clip, dude. There's M side Cafe. Not you. I need to talk to this fella. 
Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, you're the guy. I don't really care about this. I just need money. You want to play Persona 2? Does it still say I have a message? Okay, find this lady. Oh, I've got a phone number and email. Professional assistance. You told me when uh, I was being stuck, she's just pure because I've done something to her. I have to find her quickly. Like Celeste. I'm not going to find this person anymore. Okay, well, we need more money, so. Ooh, like Infernax. There you go. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Ow. You could play, um... Oh no, I can't think of another shortcut. Shadow of the Colossus, there you go. Eagle Div can beat it in like 10 minutes or something like that. Oh my god. Over there. Yeah, 10 minutes, that's what I said. There you go. Play Baldur's Gate. Ten minutes if you do the crystal special. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, probably. Uh, sure. Huh? What? Take it to that lady. Okay. Easy peasy. Ow. Oh. It's me. Hey. Hmm. Uh, yeah, good voice. I don't know. <laughs> Happy to hear it. I'm just trying to make some money so I can progress the plot. Got it. Oh, yeah, so you do have a good voice. You're welcome. You did have a good voice, I guess. Did I make money doing that? Doesn't feel like a uh, eagle death. <laughs> Gonna blow my brains out, dude. <laughs> Uh, 
Is it? Is it that hard? What did I even say to this person? No, you can't. You can't try. Denied. The f I'm sneaky beaky supreme. Dude, I forgot about that. <laughs> Uh, is that a kangaroo? We're there, didn't play one. Well. is a freak. <laughs> Thanks. I, I knew it. This is an alternate Hyrule. This game takes place in Australia. I don't know what I'm doing, dude. Dilly dilly shilly shilly. Dilly shilly shally. Speaking of which, we're start. Yeah, I'm gonna die, dude. We're starting a uh, flipping. Oh, I didn't want to do that. We're starting um Final Fantasy on Thursday. I'm real excited. Give me that. <laughs> I'm gonna shit. I pre ordered it, but just on like digital. I'm a little nervous about it fitting on the PlayStation, but find out. No, you don't. What a waste. No, oh, not this fucking dude again. My PS5 has a few games. What happened to your hat? It flew away again. Aren't you holding it? Nope. This one isn't mine. What? Mine is over there. Huh? I think you're better. So, my hat was swept away by the breeze like always. As it happens, someone else lost their hat in the breeze, too. He seems to have retrieved mine by mistake. I'm at a loss. Can't you just ask him to trade? It's not something you could just ask a guy to do, Yagami-san. Besides, he's scary looking. I'm sure he could take it the wrong way if you went up and asked about a hat. Right? Worst case scenario, a guy like that might even punch me. So, Yagami-san? I need your help on this one. Please give my hat back. That's how it's gotta be. Get the shit out of this dude, I guess. Very delicate matter, so I should probably approach him when nobody else is around. Man, I don't feel comfortable going up and asking him. How do I even approach this? I'm not opposed to that. When is a better question. But I had fun. Oh, don't yawn, you dumb bitch. Sorry. Talking to me. Right now? Mm, okay. Uh-oh. He's noticing! You should be in bed, dude. I should too, but that's neither here nor there. Dilly-dally, shilly-shally. Dilly-dally, shilly-shally.
Hide! Yeah, he'll never find me here. Still looking at. Wow, that looks bad. That with a handsome hose. Could it be they once hair like that? listening to a podcast and they were talking about Advent and children and they brought up the dilly dally shilly shally line and they were like what when I heard it the first time I was like oh that's weird and silly and then when I heard it a second or they're like that's like weird and silly and maybe maybe I misheard that and then I heard it a second time and I thought someone has to be stopped Apparently, mm -hmm. uh, a host club. We're in high school host club? Could it be that he wants to be a host? Nah. Oh, think about it, his hair does seem a little like that of a host. Huh. A lot wrong with it. Uh, what the fuck was I saying? Oh, apparently they had a real hard time translating that. Because that's not at all what she says. It's like a zoo, 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 zoo. sort of thing. It's basically like a Japanese version of blah, blah, blah. But instead of translating it as that, they did dilly dally shilly shally. Dilly dally shilly shally. I just want to progress the story, dude. Whoa. Hey, this is my chance. I did it, though. Pizza la. Wait a sec. Ouch. too hard. All right, nabbed it. Boy. 
Mm, I can't walk out the door without that. Give it back, you son of a bitch. That man's dead. I can ride my bike with no handlebars. No handlebars. Kill the hell out of that dude, dude. Hey. Uh, Nani? Nani? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> Who? One of us. One of us. <laughs> My brother of the bald. <laughs> It's playing with the breeze. <laughs> Fucking weird, dude. Jesus Christ. Oh, this one's strange, dude. Okay. Now I have enough money that I can A, go to the sewer doctor, and B, Hey, Sukuma. Really, guys? Thank you for being dead. I'm not fucking yawning, dude. Dally shilly shally. Dilly dally shilly shally. You always have. Okay. I can go pay Sukuma. Blark. Did y'all see that McDonald's is doing a, like, anime-inspired thing? themselves Wick Donalds. Yeah. 
waste. Okay, broke all the ones except Tsukumo's. <laughs> that money bro uh, give him the money. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. It's gonna take a while, but I'll let you know when I'm done. Be done so now! Okay. Now to wait for sickle man, okay. Damn it. Shit. Almost there. Nice. Almost there. Nice. Oh, did I get it? Oh, no, I failed. Oh, huh? shit. Some lock picking lawyer. I love that show, dude. All right, roll a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. I gotta fight this dude. Come on. That's a two star too. Easy peasy. Now, no more lock picking. Yes. Oh, stupid. Shit. I suck at this. Almost there. Nice. 
guys. Got it. Easy. Another fight. Not looking good. What? Okay. Ow. Eat laser sword. I hope that's not real life mortal injury. That's gonna be so annoying. I think it was. God damn it. Golem. No. style anyways One. Now, I'll go straight. Hey, I actually made it to the goal for once. Hell yeah! Huh. Oh, I didn't know I could make money doing that. I should have just come down here. Gosh darn it. Yes. Instead of actually doing jobs. Okay, that didn't. The mortal wound didn't stay. That's pretty dope. We got money now, so we can go to a restaurant. Give me one of them wet burgers. Itadagimasu. Back to it. Yep. Alright, great. I don't really care. Sure, whatever. I was about to do something. Come on, Sukumo. Call me, buddy.
Got him. What a waste. Okay, Club Sega. Play some darts. I'm not as good at darts on this game as I am on. Let's do it. Persona. Okay, we need a five o one. Oh, that's bad. It's not possible. Nice. I think the most I can get is 180. Is it going like- oh, do I do 10 rounds? Oh, hell yeah. Bowl, single 13 and a bowl. Nice. Where's 13? So close. Single nine and a double sixteen. Mm. Single twelve, single nine, and single twenty. Nice. Single twenty. I got this. Nailed it. Oh. For a second, I thought I crashed the game. Really?
Done. And stay down. <sighs> Walked out of an arcade and fucking wrecked that guy's world. Uh, I'm not. I'm a private detective. I'm not actually affiliated with the police force, so it doesn't it doesn't count. I'm actually uh, technically a lawyer. Hello. It's a long awaited time has yeah. come. That it's just long. It's just like you did that uh, in the past, actually. Civilians attacking civilians, it's fine. Mind coming over? Not at all. See you in a bit. Civilians fighting Yakuza, actually, but Okay, what am I doing? Going over here. Wow! Give me that. Says the <laughs> oh, well, they're actually can't ready. refuse a compliment. Here you go. Thanks. They're designed to blend into a power outlet, so just plug it in. Oh, and the signal range is 100 meters. It'll even go through metal plates or other obstacles, meaning you can listen from, say, the roof of a building. Convenient. That's perfect. I think this is gonna work. You can turn them off remotely too. So you don't have to listen constantly if you don't want to. I have to say, even a great detective like you would have trouble finding these, Yagamishi. <laughs> I'm not sure that's entirely true, but thanks anyway. You're a lifesaver, Tsukumo. <laughs> You're very welcome. Cool. Mushi Mushi. Okay, now I go down to here. Back to my house! Sorry. Hurdle! Sorry. This game, Francois, is just Phoenix Wright if uh, Phoenix Wright got discouraged and quit being an attorney. And also was like really good at kung fu. Hey, just stopping by for a bit. More like I got dragged here against my will. You get the bugs, Chuck? Sure did. Why are the right. weird pauses in between dialogue? I guess because it's not a legitimate cutscene. So, you want to tap the Matsugane office? Kaito-san told you, huh? Yep. Now explain what uh, you're doing, Subiro. Oh! Well, uh... That it's impossible. It was a lot. No way I can sneak in. They've literally got guys on watch, man. The cameras had seen me going in and out, too. Think about what would happen if I got caught. They beat me to death. Guess we're screwed. This isn't a joke, Kaito-san. What are we gonna do? All right, all right, chill. I thought of something else. If Sugiura doesn't want to sneak in, we'll just find you a disguise. Huh? Just tear me. <laughs> you know this guy, Tak? Who's that? Guy's got a killer jacket. One of the Matsugane goons, yeah? Yep. Name's Tashiro Kun. The snazziest fucking Yakuza in town. Guy never takes his shades off, even at night. Ooh. No. His height and build are awful close. You better not be thinking what I think you're thinking. If Tashiro Kun was wearing a face mask, nobody'd know he was actually a different person. They wouldn't have a clue. Good idea. 
So what? You want me to dress up like Tashiro Kun and infiltrate the Matsugane office? Bingo. First Bingo first, bongo. We gotta find him and grab his clothes and shades. The rest will be simple. Just walk in there and plant the bugs. Oh, and here I thought I was gonna be able to sit this part out. It's all in your capable hands now. I gotta say, Kaito-san, you really thought this through. You know, before today, I always thought I was gonna end up back in the family somehow. What's that? But there's no way. Not now that I defy the boss. Yes, there's no turning back, though. Might as well see this through to the end. Gotcha. Now let's go get Tashiro Kun's clothes. Okay. That's the thing people just say. Normally. Normal people say that. Kaito san. So. Do you, uh, have any idea where Tashiro Kun is? That's a good point. Think. Last I heard, he was working at a cabaret. Looking there might be our best bet. Which club? I think it was called Emerald Hills. Over on Shichifuku Street. Sounds like we have our next stop then. So far, dude. Really, guys? Keep up, Kaito. What are you telling me to wait up for? <sighs> Dang it. I wish I would stop yawning. Good job, Kaito. Good kidney punch. Based. Say based. Hey, do you have a second? Welcome, sirs. Table for two? Actually, we want to ask you a question. This place is a Matsugane joint, yeah? Oh, uh, yes, sir. Why do you ask? We're looking for somebody. You know a guy named Tashiro? Tashiro? Flashy jacket. Always wears his sunglasses. You've got to know the guy. Oh, him. There you go. I knew you'd know him. Any idea where he is? <laughs> Actually, he was in the club just a second ago. A customer was giving us some trouble, though. So he saw them out, personally. I'm guessing they didn't go out for drinks. Where did Tashiro take it? Probably toward Ten To hell. He said there's a back alley nobody <laughs> ever goes in there. Smart. If you're gonna beat the crap out of someone, better to do it where nobody's gonna find you. Sometimes I think you kind of miss doing that shit. Kaido. Anyway, let's get moving. Right. Thanks, pal. Oh, of course. <sighs> the flippin' rat just told me so much. Just for no reason. I was just like, hey, this is... This thing's ran by the mob, right? And you go, yep. I go, where's this one guy from the mob? He's like, well, he went that way. You're flipping fire, dude. Show me what you got. 
Okay. Find Tashira. If it's just on the street, it shouldn't be that hard to find. Let's see. No one over there. And no one over here. Looking for a back alley that no one uses. Oh my god, dude. Leave me alone. I thought this would be a good place to dump a body. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so tired, dude. Here, maybe there he is. Listen, you old fuck. Didn't you see the sign? You can look but not touch. <laughs> Please, I never touched anyone. Huh? Bullshit, you didn't. The girls know all about your pervy ass. There he is, Tashiro Kun. You, uh, weren't kidding about how he dresses. I'm actually kind of impressed. Huh? Wait. Yagami! Oh, congrats. You recognize the guy your whole family's after. Shut it, asshole! Um, I I'm just gonna... Hey! Get the hell back here! Damn it! He got away because of you! Let me guess. You made that up to try and squeeze cash out of the poor bastard. A guy like that wouldn't cop a feel even if your girl wanted him to. Huh? The fuck do you know? Huh. Sounds like you were right on the money. Of course. That's how shit goes around here. It's only fair that we take his clothes, yeah? What do you mean? The hell are you talking about? <laughs> He's a... Uh, uh, what? <laughs> promise. Fuck off! You got any idea how much these threads cost? Not a one. But you know how dangerous Commodore Cho is. Should have expected somebody want to jump you. We won't have to hurt you if you just hand them over. Everything will stay nice and clean, too. It's a win-win. So, are you stripping or not? What kind of question is that, pretty boy? If you want my clothes, you're gonna have to rip them off!
me what you got. What's wrong? Easy. No cheating involved whatsoever. Okay, let's just get this over with, Tuck. Yep, don't want anyone walking in on this. Shit, this guy's fucking loaded. His wallet's burst into the goddamn seams. Take it. Don't take his money. Oh. We're not thieves. You're right. Yeah, yeah, I know. Wait, don't clothes count as stealing? Like I said earlier, we're just borrowing them for a bit. If you say so, you're the lawyer. Man, they fit even better than I was expecting. You look good, Tuck. That's the last thing I want to hear. <laughs> anyway, you better get to the Matsugane office and plant those bugs before our friend wakes up. Speaking of, Kaito-san, think you can take care of him? Huh? What do you mean? We can't leave the guy naked outside this time of year. <laughs> Always a big softy. Sure, I'll handle him. Can't go with you anyway. Not looking like regular old Kaito. Thanks. Tuck, don't mess this up. I won't. I don't love that the lightning bolts on the back of his thing make like an SS. Kind of hate that, to be honest. Hello? <laughs> what in the absolute fuck is this? <laughs> oh, spare me. They're not my clothes. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm okay. This happened with Pokemon Go not too long ago. Alright. Well, I'm actually, it's pretty a pretty long time ago, actually. Sometimes I forget that, you know, Pokemon Go is eight years old. Um. But... They did a partner deal with this brand and uh, uh, accidentally made like an SS symbol. Everyone was like, uh oh. It was like this too with like lightning bolts. So I wonder if that's like a Japanese thing that they're just blissfully unaware of. Kind of like how, um, is it called a manji? I might, that might be wrong. Uh, it looks so much like a swastika. And that's why, especially in older games, you find them. And pe people nowadays are look at it and go, what the, why, why is this in here? And they're like, no, 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 no. It's a, it's a, di it's a different symbol. It's just a different symbol. Sorry for the wait, Sugira. Not, not different enough. <sighs> not different hey, enough, though. Sugira? Sorry, I think you have the wrong guy. <laughs> God, I just can't help it. <laughs> God, we don't have time for this. <laughs> I can't help it, man. That's the loudest disguise I've ever seen in my life. Maybe you want to try planting these instead? Sorry, sorry. It's, it's perfect. Honest. Yeah, whatever. Can we get this over with now? Yagami-san, I should be able to get a read on the bugs right after you set them. Just come on out when you're all done. Got it. So, you ready? Ready, steady. Yeah, good to go. <laughs> it's really not that funny. Yeah, you tell him, Tap. Or whatever your name is right now. Oh! Stylish as ever, Tashiro. Me and you, we gotta hit the club sometime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Tashiro. All clear at Emerald Hills? Yeah, something like that. Glad you can take care of yourself. 
We got enough to worry about looking for Yagami. Uh, by the way, mind keeping an eye on the office for me? Gonna head to the convenience store grab a snack. I'll be back in five. Oh, doesn't look like no conveniently I'm all alone now. I gotta see set these bugs before he gets back. <sighs> Convenient. Uh oh oh jeez I have five minutes um. There's a cord coming from behind this pot of plant. Is there an outlet back there? Let me try moving this. I would assume that. Yep. Suspicious. That's a bug there. Oh, oh, oh. Look, a cat. Can't go in there, I guess. An outlet, but there aren't any open spots. What right, phones do they have on this thing? I have to look for another one. Uh, that's a that's a fire hazard, dude. Suspicious. I don't know. I'll put one here. See, that's totally conspicuous, dude. I don't know what Sukuma is talking about. Could use another, but this is probably fine. Actually, I feel kind of unsatisfied. I'll put one in Matsugane son's room, just in case. Okay. Hmm. Here, I'll put one here too. Yeah, no. Hey, it's Yagami. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Now hurry up and get your ass down here. Okay. Got it. What the hell are you doing, Tashiro? You know no going in the boss's room without permission. If anything happened, it'd be on me. That well, guy got back before. much faster. Damn it. it took him way less than five minutes, is what I'm trying to say. What the? Yagami? Uh, guess I'm busted, huh? You got balls climbing into the lion's mouth knowing you're just gonna get eaten. Don't let this asshole leave here alone! Well, wait, these guys showed up way faster than I thought they would. Ah, uh, I have no health. Oh. Time out. Do I have healing items, though? No. No, not really. Just in cases, you know? That might be good, actually. I might not have even needed that. I didn't even need that. Look at me being awesome with my feet and shit. Now's my chance. <laughs> you're not getting away that easy. Say your prayers, shithead. Uh, whoa, uh, we have laws against those, you know. Laws? Says the guy who's trespassing. That's a good point. Damn it. How am I gonna get out of this? What the? Well, that'll work. Convenient. That was a close one, Yagami-san. You Did tell you me. The lights back there? Yep. Heard everything thanks to the bugs. Flip the breaker at the last second. Thanks, Sugiura. You saved my life. Won't be safe for long if we stick around here. Let's get moving. Yeah. Oh. Still no cutscene. I think we're safe now. What about the bugs? 
Can you hear what they're saying? Give me a sec. That's all it takes? Yep. Well, everything seems fine. Huh? It sounds like they're making a call already. To the man of the hour himself, Hamura. They're reporting what just went down. Can you tell where he's hiding? One sec. Uh, something about Chohan? Isn't that some kind of dice game? Guess he's at a gambling hall then. But where can you play Chohan? If we want to gamble, all we have to do is ask a gambler. And I think I know just the spot. Oh, you mean the casino? The one under Koibrai? Somebody there has to know where to find Chohan in this town. For sure. Guess in that case. Yeah, I'll handle it from here. Got it. Thanks for the backup, though. I was going to be like, he did do shit, but I guess I guess he did actually. He cut the breaker or whatever. Oh uh. uh, yeah, whatever. Okay. Oh. That's not where Corp- uh, I guess it is where Corp is. Okay, never mind. I lied. Easy squeezy. What a waste. No. No. Trying to have a gambler, it's time to start looking, I guess. He's someone who will know where to play Chohan. You. Which, uh, looks like he's pretty serious about this. Maybe I should see if he knows anything. Hey. It's not now, dickhead! Okay. No, I'm pretty sure you just have all the shit, did you say? Let's. Whoa, me. Oh. oh, you missed the fish. There we go. In the water. Okay, next. Uh. Hey. Honey, I ain't so. <laughs> That's not at all. I heard there's somewhere around here I can get in on some Chohan. You know the place? Chohan? Never heard of it. Huh? I'm in. Take me, take me. Anywhere is better than this shit hole. I'm gonna have to take a rain check on that. Can't bring you if I don't know where it is. Well, figure it out then. Okay. Fucking shit, look at the ass on her. <sighs> hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Hmm? What do you want? 
Know anywhere around here a guy can play some Chohan? Chohan, huh? Yeah, I think there's a joint in the Champion District. Heard their exclusive is all fuck. You actually know a place? Could you maybe tell me the name? Mmm, I could. Sure, but... But what? Check her out. That chick's got the goods, right? Uh, sure. I guess she's got goods. What's your point? I want to have a drink with her. Look Can you make introductions Did you look for at me? that? Filthy. I have to be a man. Filthy. A good-looking guy like you got a you, better chance you made of stealing the deal, right? <laughs> I mean, look at me. Oh, I can't believe this. You better tell me if I do this for you. Of course, man. <laughs> if I join you? Please, take a seat. I need a bad dude. You come here often? You bet. There's three things I love in life. Stiff drinks, risky bets, and handsome men. Oh, well, yeah? Well, I'll let you know if Stiff I find any. I want someone to seduce me like they do in the movies. This isn't really my thing, but I guess that's how the game is played. Okay. Me playing Can this I game. Buy you a drink? Make it a martini. A gambling woman's drink. Let me guess. Shake buy it, not stirred. Shake it, not stirred. <laughs> right, you are. You're a bigger movie buff than I expected. It didn't take a lot. Mind if I buy you one? My friend will probably want to join us too. Oh, you only want to drink? Uh huh? I just told you I'm in the gambling mood. I don't know how to play poker. I think you're at a poker table. We spice things up a bit. Here's the deal. I'll drink with you if you beat me. At <laughs> poker. I don't know how to play okay. poker. What's the deal? I'm going for pairs. I'm going oh. I'm going for pairs. Yeah. <laughs> Seems I won. Did you? He wins. Well, you know the. <laughs> There's something of an art to it, isn't there? Let a team you and I. What do you mean you won? We both. All right, I'll join you for this drink. Really? Both decided to fault. Let me grab my friend. Hey, why are you the one having all the fun? She agreed to drink with us after a game. Now go grab some seats. Wait, seriously? Ha, I owe you for this, man! You're damn right you do. I need to know where I can play Chohan, remember? Oh, yeah. It's in the Champion District. Only shop without a sign. You can't miss it. Bar with no sign. Knock on the shutter three times, and they'll ask you what you want. You respond with the password, Can I talk to move? Knock three times, then the password. Next, they'll say he says he wants the steak, to which you respond, Chateaubriand, blue. And that's it. Joints underground, but clearly that ain't a problem for you. Thanks. That's a huge help. Now let's get drinking. I'm going to Actually, have to remember all this. I think I'm going to have to pass. I need to go. You're lost, pal. An ass like that is a one Yeah, yeah, yeah. She likes vodka martinis. Order it shaken, not stirred. Tastes worse that way. The hell's that supposed to mean? Oh, Jesus. Yo. Kaito-san. Sugiura told me you'd be here. So, you find out where Hamura is? Maybe. Yep. A gambling hall in the Champion District. Really? Where at? Apparently the only store without a sign. They've got the club set up underground. Oh, fancy. By the way, talk. 
What happens when you find Hamura? Mm, kiss a little. Do his vent. After everything he's done, he deserves it. If I'm honest, I'd take more joy in seeing him squirm than finding the mole right about now. <laughs> Glad we're on the same page. Feels like the end of the chapter. Let's go. Hey, we'll do this real quick. Is it? Oh, actually, we'll go over here. Because I need to buy some healing items. My insta kill hasn't finished reloading yet. Um. Can't go that way. Cool, that's... Hold up. Hmm? I don't see a sign anywhere. This where we get in the gambling hall? Maybe. Glad I didn't. Glad I didn't stop there. Go to next week, cause I would have not remembered that. For a steak now. 
But not Chateaubriand Blue. Like, like a blue steak, really? I thought it should like medium, medium rare, medium well. I always order it medium. I can eat it medium well or medium rare, but they'll mess it up if I order it medium well. So I just get medium. It'll, it'll be somewhere in that range, generally. Eight hundred. Is that him? No. No. Go already. Hurry up. Oh, there he is. Kaita son. Oh, that's down. All right. Let's go. Show it. Yes. There we go. Two, two, <laughs> even. Oh. I'm on fucking fire tonight. <laughs> Hell yeah, Captain. We're just getting started. <laughs> hey! Watch your fucking feet! Are you fucking serious? Get the fuck out of here! Such a small world, isn't it? You're not exactly an easy man to find. Mm. Shit. Ozaki! <laughs> Huh? Ready, talk? Okay, Let, let's make this quick. Jesus, God. Done yet? Or do you want me to keep hitting you? Oh, fuck you. You hired the thief that stole the money from the office that day. It was all just a setup, wasn't it, Hollera? What, memories of looting you? It's all water under the bridge, isn't it? Now that I can do this. What about the mole? Everything he does is under your command, huh? How many people has the mole murdered? 
All those Kyori guys, Shintani, no way those are the only ones. Shintani, before he got murdered, was so sure the mole wasn't part of some Yakuza war. He wouldn't have said that without information to support it. And so, you had to silence him. Made the mole use Ayabe's gun to hide the trail. Like hell I did. Shintani knew your secret. He knew the mole murders were linked to the ADDC. All this comes right back to 89, doesn't it? Shove it up your ass! Now hands off, or I'm gonna fucking kill you! You seriously never listen, huh? Hamura. The center's director, Kido. Is he the one who's behind all this carnage? Is it Kido? Is that not right? <laughs> Start talking quick, asshole. And not feeling it, huh? Then how about I kill you right here? Kaito san! <laughs> Shintani tried to reach the center. He wasn't trying to talk to Director Kido at all. It does seem we received a phone call from this Shintani-san you speak of. Do you know who he was calling? Dr. Shona. Hashiki, too. He was trying to get information out of Shono until someone got to him. So the one I want... It's Shono, huh? Right, Hamura? Hey! Fire! Fire! Guess someone's got it out for us, huh, Talk? Captain! Kaito-san! Oh, Donkey Punch. A grenade. This is fine. Hamura's gone. Well, it looks like his shithead boys took him out of here. <sighs> Holy hell. I'm just glad we're still alive. Okay, there it is. Nope. Okay, we ended there. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, Misfit's online. Cool, we'll read out to Misfit. Um. I will be back. I don't know when. Tuesday for sure. With some Persona 3. Um. And then we're starting Final Fantasy VII on a different day. Thursday, I will be back here for War Judgment on Friday. And there might be more games in, in between those. There might not be. I don't know. Until then. Thank you all so much for hanging out. 
please enjoy the rest of your day and or night and please remember to be kind to one another and i will see you all in the next one till then bye bye